there anything better in the taste of delicious barbecue ribs? Especially when they're slathered with my thick, tangy, homey, homestyle barbecue rib sauce. <clears throat> Once you've tried it, you'll never want to be without it. For barbecue that ain't phony, it's got to be homey. Sergeant Hogwash. General Oxford is on his way down from Texas. His boys are gonna do some top secret Anarctic core ice trading. Oxford has promised his boys a Texas-style barbecue before they start. You know what we say in the Corps, Sergeant. An army marches on its stomach. Yes, sir, they do, sir. Painful as that sounds, sir. That airdrop contains all the Texas barbecue fixins you'll need. Carry on. Now this here's a barbecue-wee! Mess for a Texas battalion can't be a teeny weenie roast. It calls for a full-scale Texas-style grill. Now, I'll tell you what, that there beef is still on the hoof. As you were, penguin! <laughs> Just wouldn't be a barbecue without Mama Hogwatch's famous country coleslaw recipe. Cleanses the palate, don't you know? Pop, you frosty little freeloader! Oh, no, you don't! <laughs> yeah. Hot diggity dog! The flight simulator unit will make the perfect mixing bowl. And everybody knows that the key to any great barbecue is in the sauce. And my super secret recipe would make 50 miles of Texas desert taste good. Yes, sir, come on. Ten hot! Insubordination will not be tolerated, especially from an Step out of line again, and I'll bust you down to a scallion. Company, stand by to mix. Especially with that side of beef in tow. Gotcha! And you are now clear for launch, little soldier. Mama Hogwash used to say, a barbecue without beans is like a barbecue without beans.
Uh, Major Bull, sir, uh, the barbecue isn't ready. Actually, it's a total disaster. All the cause of one penguin, sir. What do you mean it's not ready? Then who did that? Huh? Texas size shish kebabs. Hmm. Now that's army ingenuity. At ease, little recruit. Why don't you join me at my picnic table? But, sir, he's no recruit. He's a penguin. Zip it, soldier. You're gonna be peeling potatoes for the next year for leaving this barbecue to a subordinate. <laughs> he's no subordinate. He, he's a penguin. Mmm, <laughs> mmm. This barbecue's the best I've ever tasted. You've got real potential, soldier. How'd you like to run the officer's mess from now on? is a mess. C. Tenant will maintain property in condition in which it was rented. But, but, and said tenant will be out on his tail feathers if this place isn't spick and span in one hour! Oh, man. I'm gonna miss my pre-game practice on the driving range. Hmm. If I gotta clean up, I might as well have a little sport and fun while I'm at it. Cha cha cha. Like I always say, if you can't see the mess, there is no mess. Hmm. This calls for a putter. Well, that ought to do. Ah, of course, shit off, woodpecker. That's where your coat was all along. Let the healing cleanup games begin! First event, the Mighty Hammer Crush! Okay then, it's on to the kitchen for some deep sink diving! Soak for a minute. Ah! It is time for some cleaning justice. Oh, 
a matter of balance and control. There's no way he could have cleaned up that mess by now. I'll finally get rid of that good-for-nothing woodpecker once and for all. before she comes too. Are you okay, Miss Meanie? You must have passed out from the cleaning fumes. I was so busy scrubbing this place spotless that I didn't even see you come in. Huh? I don't remember any fumes. Say, where is everything? Uh, how about, uh, I sent the furniture out to be shampooed. <laughs> yeah. I know what you did. You just hit everything in. Huh? Woodpecker, I don't know what to say. You did an amazing job cleaning. How in the heck did you do it so fast? Eh, nothing to it. Just a bit of elbow grease and some old-fashioned woodpecker know-how. Hmm. Hiya, buddy. Sorry I'm late, pal. Had a little mess on my hands. I can beat that. Mind if I am? Not too hot! Oh well, sand trap, water hazard, living room. Definitely a three iron. Now that's a clean shot. <laughs> uh... 